There's nothing like chilling with my girls. Just me and my divas taking over the world. What's up, Divas? What's up, Divas? What's up, YouTube bros? YouTube friends? YouTube fam? What's up? What's up? I'm going to try to work this wig. Like, we're going to try to make it meltable or at least passable. I've had this for a minute, and, you know, I have been super busy. I have been a um, new grandmother, so I've had a lot going on, girl. And it's been sitting, bless you, Penny, it has been sitting in my bathroom ready to be plucked and applied. Now, I did pluck some of it, but I don't really know if that helped. I just know that when I first got it, I was like, girl, how is this going to work out in my favor? But we're just going to try. We're just going to try. Now, I'm pretty sure the name of the company is like Ashy Mary, um, Asha Mary. I mean, Asmary. I don't really know how you would pronounce it, but I'm going to definitely post it down below. But I mean, I'm thinking that it's called Ashy Mary. Ashy Mary. Okay. So, yeah, that's that's what I'm thinking it's called. And if it is, like, can you please tell me why you're calling your website Ashy Mary? Because what is the purpose? What is the sole goal of anybody being called Ashy Mary? Like, we don't want our lace to look ashy. And I don't know about who Mary is, but some of these websites be choosing, like, the strangest names. It has nothing to do with a wig, hair, bundles, lashes, nothing. It's just, like, some weird name. It could be called, you look maybe pretty today. And they sell wigs. Like, okay, so maybe I look pretty today and I want to buy a wig for me. But anyway, we just going to see how the wig comes. And then I'm going to show y'all how I try to melt the lace or at least lay the hair. Maybe I'm a soldier, standing my ground. So if you're gonna find me for my heart, are you gonna get it? Red or dark? Maybe I'm a tiger, 27 Maybe I'm a bite for one bite, you're dead. So if you're gonna find me for my heart, are you gonna get it? Red or dark? What can I say any more than desire? More than just a pretty face. So girl, you better walk away. Oh yeah, oh yeah. Only one love beside the fire. Someone who can handle me Someone got your heart to be Oh yeah, oh yeah If you try to come closer I'ma give you some closure Before you know it, it's over So run away, run away I'm not trying to hurt you But I will if I have to I'ma tell you what I do Run away, run away Baby, I'm a fighter, never backing down Baby, I'm a soldier, standing my ground So if you're gonna fight me for my heart Are you gonna get these battle scars? Baby, I'm a tiger, 20 steps ahead Baby, I'm a bike, go and bike you dead So if you're gonna fight me for my heart Are you gonna get these battle scars? Baby, I'm a fighter, never backing down Baby, I'm a soldier, standing my ground So if you're gonna fight me for my heart Are you gonna get these battle scars? Baby, I'm a tiger, 20 steps ahead Baby, I'm a bike, go and bike if you're gonna fight me for my heart, are you gonna get these battle scars? What can I do? Gotta keep every heart safe. So I always use a wig block mannequin head to melt the lace or press the hairline down with a hot comb, baby, with a hot comb. Now, as y'all see, this hairline is a little bit tad bit different. So you definitely want to get you a canvas block head because they are so beneficial, honey, to lay in the hairline as close as possible without burning your own skin. I mean, if you like to burn it yourself, girl, go for it then. Put it on and just do it. But girl, you can get these things anywhere. The best place I would suggest getting you a canvas block head would be what? Amazon Prime. Get your stuff on time. You can get them in all different sizes. I would suggest getting a 23 if you're gonna use it to make a wig, but just get you a 23. I would suggest getting like a 23. That way you have enough circumference so that the wig can be, stick comfortably on the canvas while you hot comb. It's very helpful in styling. I don't wanna waste no time. Oh yeah, oh yeah. Try to play nice so I won't give you heartache. Trust me baby when I say, girl you better walk away. Oh yeah, oh yeah. If you try to come closer, I'ma give you some closure. Before you know it, it's over. 
to put on my comb so that way I don't spray too much on the unit um, I did want to explain that some lace is different than others this is not transparent lace or crystal lace so the lace is a tad bit thicker and with this particular unit I am going to I did need to blow dry it with a little bit of heat which is fine normally this hairspray you can just allow it to air dry but sometimes depending on the lace you might need to use a little heat now, because the hairline is a little bit different, I'm just gonna use the baby hairs, the hairline to my advantage, and just, you know, swoop me some baby hairs. And I'm telling you guys, this mousse from Janet Collection is everything. I love it, it smells really good, and it swoops and scopes like nobody's business. So if you have not tried it, I would suggest getting you a can. I have seen it at the beauty supply stores, but I've seen the hairspray. I didn't see the mousse, but I'm pretty sure they carry but you know you can always look on amazon amazon has everything honey everything including the kitchen sink so you can definitely check on amazon but i did bleach the unit and i used the 30 developer i um allowed it to sit on the hair for probably like about 45 minutes or hour and i wasn't really sure if i really wanted to tweeze the hairline so much so i just decided to just tweeze a little bit especially from the way that it was created and i know you guys seen that in the showcase when i did feature the wig on the mannequin head so i just said let me not mess around with this too much 
because I don't want to ruin the hairline of it or just tweeze too much and then there's you know sits all the way back but so for me um I would suggest when it, there's always different ways and methods of drying your your uh your unit like when you adhere it and a lot of those ways do actually um are beneficial to how the lace looks some wigs I noticed you can allow them to air dry when you spray hairspray on it and the lace will be kind of like see-through with this particular one I would suggest using heat to air dry it or to dry the the uh, hairspray because once you add hairspray to this and then you allow it to air dry it is kind of um invisible but if you add heat to it with the hairspray it becomes a lot more unnoticeable so that's a very important rule with certain lace. If you add heat to some, you might see it more. If you add less heat to some lace wigs, you might see it lace. It's just like, um, you know, trial and error. You definitely have to try it out. But I thought these baby hairs was cute with this. You know, something different. I was just trying to hide the edges. This, the lace is not that bad, but it is not crystal. And I know a lot of people are used to that. Now I'm going to use this Got To Be Styling Mousse Spot called Fantastic. I got this years ago at the Dollar Tree. And I did purchase quite a few cans of it. I only use it to curl my hair. I do not use it to sculpt my baby hairs. Because it will lift your wig up. And I've noticed that. But to curl your hair and to tame the hair. Really great product. Especially for a dollar honey. Okay. And that's basically it. <laughs> I can make you stay Cause baby I love you Why you tryna break us up When I'm tryna build it up I wish I could make you stop Cause baby I love you Guess I'm gonna dance alone tonight I'm gonna miss your body You know I can never get it right Without you, no I don't wanna step into the light If I don't get you shoddy you bring out the sweetness of my life, oh yeah Come on and give me that, give me that, give me that good, good loving Come on and show me that, show me that, show me that you're the one I move to the left while you move to the right While you tryna fight, just Come on and give me that, give me that, give me that good, good loving All right, you guys, so this actually came out cute. Ashy Mary, Ashy Mary, what? Like, I don't really know the name. Like, that's how I'm pronouncing it. But it came out cute. Now, is it the best lace in the world? It's not transparent. I mean, you can't see it, but it's not like um, crystal lace. Like, you, you know it's there, honey. It's not that noticeable, depending on what hairspray you use and how you go about um, slicking it down. So that's the reason why I do have so many um, baby hairs like this because I didn't want the edges to show. I don't really do this much of a baby hair type thing, but it's trending. It's in like, you know, just, just able to do it to save grace for the wig. And I'm gonna say this, this Janet Collection Styling Moves Girl, it's a godsend. It's heaven sent. It's amazing. I love it. Um, you see how nicely it sculpts your hair is down girl i'm not sure if they come in bigger cans if they don't they need to but this stuff is like the best styling mousse ever i mean that's in my opinion now i know i do like the dollar tree store mousse the salon selectors but that ain't got nothing on this okay i'm just gonna be honest with you it is a really good styling mousse but this just styles it automatically just like right there instantly freezes it and that's what i like about this but you know this is how i swoop them down the hair is very dense like very full you know what i'm saying it has a lot of volume to it which i like and um it curls super easy um i did cut off a lot you know as you've seen on the edges 
I just noticed that when you when it's certain lace fronts, like a 13 by 4 and it's all the way across, you always have to end up cutting over the ear tabs because it always just be like so big or long or just girl listen. Customize the damn with. But um for the most part came out good, you know what I'm saying? Came out nice. Ashy Mary, honey. Ashy Mary. I put some put my foot in Ashy Mary. I sure did. But I am getting affordable vibe. And I am getting like girl, you could rock this out vibe. And I am getting like girl, if you got skills, you can rock this, you can do this. You can actually perform well in this wig and make it work for you. You know what I'm saying? It's not one of those bad lace wigs where you see it from across the room and you be like, let me see how lace, honey. It is a decent lace. Is it, is it Swiss? I doubt it, but it is decent. So if you can rock this, if you can work around it, if you can make it do what it do, boo. I'll post all of their information down below for you guys. Let me know what you think about this unit. Did I rock her out? Did I make her, did I do justice to her or what, honey? But I love you all. Make sure you rate, comment, subscribe, thumbs the video up. I got to go. Um, on that note, I will see y'all in another video. Make sure that you thumbs it up. Tell your friends, your mamas, your daddies, your uncles, your cousins, your boyfriends, your husbands, your ex-boyfriends, your besties, your co-workers, your non-co-workers, your enemies to check the video out. Subscribe to the channel and thumbs the video up. Make sure you check the description box down below. And on that note, I got to go. And I'll see y'all in the next video.